It's 6.15. I don't even know what day it is. I'm so freaking tired. I've slept one and a half hour re-exporting yesterday's vlog five times. And it failed, well it completed every single time. But four of the times it cut off like 40, 45 seconds of the end. And then the last part, that was when I got the one and a half hour sleep the file was just one second long so yeah I, I decided to give up and just upload the vlog and I'm gonna go down to get breakfast and then I'm going out to to some waterfalls today near uh, Budlan there are as far as I know there are three waterfalls so it should be a really great day I hope I just need to like wake up a bit more <sighs> One eternity later. All right, okay. We are back to normal on my normal vlogging setup. This should be pretty sweet. I'm about to go down to find a jeepney. We'll see how that goes. <laughs> Man, this is bright. And now it's not bright. What's going on? Jesus Christ. Okay, it's kind of weird to be back to vlogging on this big setup. But I like it though. It's all good, and now, yeah, well, now it's, now it's kind of annoying that I've gotten used to, <laughs> to this shooting auto, and now I have to adjust everything all the time. But it's all good, I can get to work out my, uh, my right arm again. Why we do it, baby? I have no clue. <laughs> I'm vlogging here. Don't have time to to take care of traffic. Okay, so I have no clue what waterfall we're going to. All I know is we need to get a, a motorbike to get there. So I'm just following Macy and then yeah, we'll see where we end up. All right, so we've got a motorbike and it's gonna cost us 50 pesos per person. And then they asked us about a guide, which is 300. That trip up here was really intense because they were driving really fast in the turns so you were just like almost leaning sideways and I do not feel comfortable on the back of a motorbike when they go that fast in the turns but it's good starting with off with some adrenaline all right we signed into the book the log book as you do with everything around here and we got a price of 400 pesos for a guide with unlimited hours to three different waterfalls that is in this area i'll put it down here <laughs> Sweating like hell, but we made it to the first fall. This is Lutod Falls. I don't know if you can tell, but it's heart shaped. It's pretty cool. All right, and straight behind this, that way, is Kabang Falls. So we're gonna see what that's like right now. 
Kabang Falls, right here. But apparently it's low tide, so this is as crazy as it gets. It only changes when it's uh, when it rains, and then Lutot is just over there. Wouldn't mind going for a swim right now. All right, switch to the GoPro, and. Macy just told me that while I was shooting, the guide said that if we're gonna jump in, then we need to throw a rock in the water or a coin. Because according to superstition, a lot of poor people has died here or jumping in the water or something. So yeah, don't plan on dying today. All right, so peace offering for the waterfall god. And another one. Should be good. So it's not it's not the furthest I've jumped. It's just a bit sketchy because the water is like dark. But Ron says it's okay, so I trust him. So we'll go. Are you gonna jump here if I jump? Probably. Probably? Is this a car <laughs> as high as the one in Tardo? No. Like this? No. I would say the, the lower one is a bit higher, maybe a couple of meters. Okay. <laughs> no! Okay, here we go. Go! Woo! Your turn! Oh, that's a grave for all the dead people. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, uh, yeah. Go for it. <laughs> All good? You good? Yeah, that was better than the. I'm good. Uh, what was the game again? Kabagno? Kabagno? Yeah, she hit her ass in that one. <laughs> Should have brought my river shoes. Alright, so this, uh, this is the lowest of all the waterfalls here. And then the very last one is the one I actually came here for because you can go inside a cave behind the waterfall according to according to a, a photo I saw. So. Okay, so to be honest, there's nothing special about these two waterfalls because the water only gets like the, the water flow only gets more intense when it starts raining. So, yeah, you can only go here, like, I would say it's only worth going here when it's raining. And then, if you're into video like I am, you can't really do a lot of shooting. Well, you can, but you better have some good equipment or it's not going to be good for your equipment. Alright, time for a drone shot. So that is the first two waterfalls down. So because of the summer season, it's not the best time for waterfalls. Ron, uh, what season would you say is the best to come here for the waterfalls? I think the month of October. October? Okay, so, okay, so October month would probably be the best time to come for the waterfalls. Uh, maybe I should do the rest of the waterfalls in October then.
So apparently in this waterfall, they have electrical catfish. What the hell? I never heard about that before. Electrical catfish, jeez. Tinizig Wang Falls. That is where the cave is behind the water. But again, because of the time of year, there's not, uh, there's not a lot of water. But, I mean, it's still pretty cool. And, and also, now I know how cool, like how, how good of a potential it, this has to be freaking amazing. So I'll probably be back in October because Ron said that that was the best time to be here probably. All right, so we made it. Whoop, that's the cave and this is the water that you would get at the top during the summertime. So pretty cool, I'm gonna go for it. going up this steep as hell path with a lot of roots. <sighs> Probably not the best time to, to be vlogging, but that would also make the exact best time to vlog. <sighs> Stop complaining! Ah. Whew. Ah. Man, that was tough. And I just dried my shirt. So now it's getting all wet again. Uh, Gary. Piggyback? Yeah. Nope. Ain't gonna happen. I'm tired. I'm gonna take a nap. One and a half hours of sleep. I don't recommend it. So I'll see you guys later. Guys, okay, so I just woke up and it is 1 a.m. So I think I slept for yeah, 10 plus hours. Who said a vlogger's life was easy? <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I am gonna end the vlog here, so I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching. Peace! Would definitely recommend this fall. I just can't remember the name. <laughs> and the guide told us that most people come here on Saturday and Sunday, so that would be locals. So yeah, we had it basically, we, we have it to ourselves now. But the first, I guess, five minutes we were here, 
there was uh, maybe four people 